As soon as he was born, he farted and shot himself out of his mother's womb. From then on, he farted every minute of every day. His father was annoyed and made him a bag. But when he farted, the bag hit the scissors. That's how the father got hurt. But the father came up with another idea and he made an exhaust pipe for Pakel. This time it should be foolproof. But father didn't realize that Pakel would be attracted to toys. And just like that, father's ambulance took him away. Soon, Pakel reached school age and his classmates hated him. Only Alan was willing to play with Pakel because he was born without a sense of smell. The two soon became best friends. Alan tried to invent some devices for Pakel. The first one was anti-fart pants. It works well and Pakel becomes cheerful. However, a bully at school finds Pakel's storage device and opens it. After that, Alan invents a flying machine. Pakel sat on it and the flying machine flew without power. Alan's invention caught the attention of the state. They selected Alan to serve the country. Having lost his friend, Pakel salt. On a whim, he farts, causing a spotlight to fall and kill someone. Pakel is prepared for execution as a murderer. But before the execution, a man in black saves him. It turns out to be Alan who has returned. He is already a senior scientist in the country and hands Pakel an important mission. They are to use Pakel's farts as a launch energy source for a rocket to rescue astronauts not trapped in space. The devilish training begins even during meals. Pakel is on the treadmill. The work pays off. The engine is built. But just before launch, the rocket malfunctioned. The stranded astronauts can't wait for the repairs to be completed. Pakel insisted on launching. Thanks to his efforts, the rocket successfully lifted off and rescued the astronauts. And he became a hero of the country. 